how to draw a graph when a pair of linear equations are uh, given to us and those linear equations are giving us an infinite solution and a consistent system. Check whether the following equations are consistent or inconsistent. Solve them graphically. 4 by 3x plus 2y is equals to 8. 2x plus 3y is equals to 12. But how to say them? So this is the first part of my question. That is I have to say whether the equations are consistent or inconsistent. And also second part of the question is I have to solve them graphically. So when can I say two equations are consistent? I can say two equations are consistent when they have one or more than one solution. Right. Then they are called as consistent system. Then when is a system called as inconsistent? When they have no solution. So by drawing the graph, if we get there are solutions, we can say the system is uh, so consistent. If we do not get any solution, that is if the lines do not meet, then we can say the system is inconsistent. Uh, the first part of the question is, we have to check whether the equations are consistent or inconsistent. So first we'll check. How to check? First make them in standard form of a1x plus b1y plus c1 is equals to so compare a1x plus b1y plus c1 is equals to 0 with this equation. a1 is 4 by 3. So I wrote 4 by 3. a1 by a2 is 4 by 3 by a2 is 2. So by 2. Now 4 by 3 by 2 can be written as 2 by 1. So 4 by 3 by 2 by 1. If it goes that side, it becomes into 1 by 2. It becomes reciprocal. When 2 by 1 denominator goes in numerator, it will become reciprocal. So 1 by 2. Now here, 2 1s are 2, 2 2s are 4. So a1 by a2 is equals to 2 by 3. Now see b1, b1 is 2, b2 is 3 if you compare. So b1 by b2 is 2 by 3, okay. And c1 by c2 is, c1 is minus 8, c2 is minus 12, so minus minus gets cancelled. Here 2 4s are 8, 2 6s are 12, 2 2s are 4, 2 3s are 6. So I'm getting a1 by a2 is also 2 by 3, b1 by b2 is also 2 by 3 and c1 by c2 is also 2 by 3. So finally what did I get? a1 by a2 is equals to b1 by b2 is equals to c1 by c2. When this, when does this condition occur? This condition occurs when the solutions are infinite. That is infinitely many solutions. And what I had to say here, what I had to check, I had to check whether the system is consistent or inconsistent according to the question. So what will I write? System is consistent. Now I will plot the points on a graph for drawing infinitely many solutions equation since i have three in denominator here i want to remove this three so how can i remove this three i can multiply with three on both lhs and rhs to remove the three in denominator so that my equation will be simplified okay so multiply with everything three into four by three x plus three into two y is equals to 3 into 8. Okay. So here 3 1s are 3. 3 1s are 3. So what am I left with? 4x plus 3 2s are 6y is equals to 3 8s are 24. This is my equation. Now what I'll do is I'll keep 6y as it is and I'll send this plus 4x that side. So 24 minus 4x because I need y variable on one side. Because I'll substitute all the points in y. So y is equals to 24 minus 4x by 6. This I got. Now, I'll put x is equals to 0 and find out what is y. y is equals to 24 minus 4 into 0 by 6. So, y is equals to 24 minus 4 zeros are 0, 24 by 6. 24 minus 0 is 24. 6 ones are 6, 6 fours are 24. y is equals to 4. So, when x is 0, I got y is 4. Now, put x is equals to 3. y is equals to 24 minus 4 into 3 by 6. Y is equal to 24 minus 4 threes are 12. So 12 by 6. Y <coughs> is equal to 24 minus 12 is 4 minus 2 is 2. And 2 minus 1 is 1. 12 by 6. 6 ones are 6. 6 twos are 12. So Y is equals to 2 I have. Okay. So when x is 3, y is 2. So put x is equal to minus 3, 24 minus 
माइनस इंटू माइनस इज प्लस ट्वेंटी फोर प्लस ट्वेल्व बाई सिक्स ट्वेंटी फोर प्लस ट्वेल्व इज फोर प्लस टू इज सिक्स टू प्लस वन इज थ्री थर्टी सिक्स बाई सिक्स सिक्स वन जा सिक्स 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 जा थर्टी सिक्स सो वेन एक्स इज थ्री वाई इज सिक्स द वैल्यू ऑफ वाई बाय पुटिंग डिफरेंट वैल्यूज ऑफ एक्स इन दिस सेकेंड इक्वेशन पुट थ्री वाई ऑन दिस साइड एंड आई टेक दिस टू एक्स अदर साइड सो वाई इज इक्वल्स टू ट्वेल्व माइनस टू एक्स बाय थ्री वाई इज इक्वल्स टू ट्वेल्व माइनस टू इंटू जीरो बाय थ्री टू जीरो जा जीरो सो वाई इज इक्वल्स टू ट्वेल्व माइनस जीरो बाय थ्री दैट इज नथिंग बट ट्वेल्व बाय थ्री थ्री वन जा थ्री थ्री फोर जा ट्वेल्व सो वाई इज इक्वल्स टू फोर सो वॉट डू आई गेट वेन एक्स इज जीरो वाई इज फोर नाउ पुट एक्स इज इक्वल्स टू माइनस थ्री पुट एक्स इज इक्वल्स टू माइनस थ्री वाई इज इक्वल्स टू इन दिस इक्वेशन आई पुट इंग ट्वेल्व माइनस टू इंटू माइनस थ्री बाई थ्री वाई इज इक्वल्स टू ट्वेल्व माइनस इंटू माइनस इज प्लस सिक्स बाई थ्री वाई इज इक्वल्स टू ट्वेल्व प्लस सिक्स एटीन थ्री वन जा थ्री थ्री सिक्स जार एटीन सो वेन एक्स इज माइनस थ्री वाई इज सिक्स पुट एक्स इज इक्वल्स टू थ्री सो वाई इज इक्वल्स टू ट्वेल्व माइनस टू इंटू थ्री बाय थ्री सो वाई इज इक्वल्स टू ट्वेल्व माइनस टू थ्री जा सिक्स सिक्स बाय थ्री ट्वेल्व माइनस सिक्स इज सिक्स सिक्स बाय थ्री थ्री वन जा थ्री थ्री टू जा सिक्स सो वॉट डू आई गेट वाई इज इक्वल्स टू टू ओके सो दीज आर द पॉइंट्स इन अ टेबल दिस पॉइंट जीरो माइनस थ्री थ्री आर फॉर द इक्वेशन फोर बाय थ्री एक्स प्लस टू वाई इज इक्वल्स टू एट एंड दीज पॉइंट्स टू एक्स जीरो माइनस थ्री एंड थ्री आर फॉर टू एक्स प्लस थ्री वाई इज इक्वल्स टू ट्वेल्व वॉट डू आई ऑब्जर्व फॉर दिस ऑल्सो वॉट एवर एक्स वैलीज आई पुट सेम वैल्यूज ऑफ वाई एम गेटिंग यर सी जीरो फोर जीरो फोर माइनस थ्री सिक्स माइनस थ्री सिक्स थ्री टू थ्री टू वाई बिकॉज बो द लाइन्स ओवरलैप ईच अदर वाई बिकॉज दे आर Having infinitely many solutions, we know that infinitely many solutions we have overlapping lines. So now let us plot the points. So for both of them, we have the same graph. See the points. X is zero, y is four. This points belong to both the equations. So only one time I'll plot and I'll write both the equations on the line because the same points are there for both the equations. When x is zero, y is four means this is the point zero comma four. Second point is when x is minus three, y is six. When x is minus three, y is six. Here is the point minus three comma six. Third point is when x is three, y is two. This is the point when x is three, y is two. Now I will join all both the three points, all the three points very carefully. In such a way that they intersect both the x-axis and the y-axis. Okay. So as we have the same set of points minus three comma six, zero comma four, three comma two for both the equations. Okay. I'm having the same line. Same lines are on the overlap each other. Okay. So here I have my first equation. I'll write. Why I'm putting two arrows? This one line to this line is my first equation, and this line to this line is my second equation. So I'll write the first equation on this side and the second equation on that side. Okay, four by three x plus two y is equals to eighty eight is my first equation. Two x plus three y is equals to twelve is my second equation. So what did I what did I observe? There are three points lying on the same line. That is, it has infinitely many solutions. So, from graph, I have infinitely many solutions. Lines are overlapping. So, what is the system? The system is consistent. That only I had to see in the question. In the question, it asked me whether the system is. consistent or not so i got that the system is consistent since i have so many solutions i have uploaded a videos on unique solution and parallel lines please share the video with your friends and also hit the like button thank you